millions of XRP shifted in big whale transaction. We're going to talk about what happened here and uh, what is going on with XRP. Of course, we had the party last night. Nothing really came of it. You know, it was kind of like a, ah, you know, kind of a letdown a little bit. We're seeing XRP down a little bit, about 3%. But I heard the party was great in general. I mean, this was a great opportunity to... Uh, you know, uh, celebrate, right, for the for the victory that uh, Ripple had. But we kind of thought more would be coming. Maybe we read a little bit too deep in between the lines uh, when, you know, we heard that, you know, there'd be some big news here on the event. But uh, all in all, XRP still sitting above 50 cents. And we are gearing up for a big October. And we do have to talk about these big whale transactions and, and what's going on here. So a lot to unpack. In this video, make sure you guys stick around until the end because we've got some special uh, things to deliver to you, making sure you're ready as we finally turn the page away from September and into October. Well, let's start here. Millions of XRP on the move transferred in an instant in a massive whale transaction according to Crypto Data Tracker Whale Alert. Now, guys, listen to this. A total of 36 million XRP worth nearly $19 million were moved from an unidentified whale wallet to BitThumb, one of South Korea's top crypto exchanges. This is usually indicating a sell-off. I'm just saying, don't shoot the messenger here. But what does this mean? Well, I mean, here's the thing. 18 plus million, 19 plus million, it's a lot. It's a lot, but it wouldn't drastically just tank the price. We'd have to have more whales sending their crypto to exchanges in order to drastically impact the price here, okay? Now, we know XRP remains a very popular crypto asset among South Korean traders. Maybe this is just a swing trade here, right? BitThumb, uh, it is the most traded asset over there, overtaking Bitcoin, which is crazy. Tokens are moved to exchanges for a variety of purposes, one of which is to sell them. That's usually the number one reason. Other reasons could include staking and airdropping, whatever the case may be. Here, the specific reason for the XRP token transfer is unknown at this time. So, uh, Garlinghouse, by the way, had this to say regarding the party. Looking forward to seeing many of you tonight at the proper party. Excited to bring people together to celebrate what has collectively been achieved. A reminder to the SEC that court decisions matter uh, and that progress is worth fighting for. So that's interesting. Uh, and here's the thing. Um, this isn't a huge, huge deal when it's a one-off. It is a big deal when we see millions of XRP shifted by not one big whale, but multiple whales. If we started to see a pattern here of a ton of people sending their XRP to exchanges, then we have to look at it a little bit closer, right? Right. We can see the price. Uh, it is still up in the last seven days a little bit, but there's the big drop-off from the party there last night. Not much going on. Uh, in here in the one month, we're down slightly, 1.58%, like barely anything right now. Uh, here in the one year, still up about 8% because we popped up to, you know, uh, over 80 cents uh, on the heels of the big news, right? So where is XRP heading next? What can we expect here with XRP? And this is the all chart, by the way, you're taking a look at. Well, let me tell you this. If this market turns for Bitcoin and October historically is a great month, I think XRP could be the number one altcoin in the top 100 that will run hot. Because of all the institutional demand that is pent up, because of us just waiting for a switch to be flipped, XRP, I think, is still out of the top 100, one of, if if not the strongest crypto that has some of the most upside at this price point. Buyers and sellers have kind of met in the middle at this 52 cent mark, 50 cent mark, you know, this, this range, 48 to 52 cents. We're just waiting. We're just waiting for the next blow off move blow off top move, right? So in this next bull cycle, I think we're going to fly past all-time highs. I think $10 is a pretty strong price target, 8 to $10. And it's just a matter of time until we start to move. 
XRP now, with what we know about the lawsuit, is primed and ready. And it's all about patience right now. It's all about hanging on until this market as a whole moves, and the money will flow into XRP. XRP has been the most heavily traded crypto in the United States in 2023. Let me say that again. XRP is the most heavily traded crypto in the United States in 2023. Follow the money. Follow the green. And the same could be said when we look outside the U.S. too for XRP. So hang in there. We're gearing up. I think we're coiling up. I think this is the beginning stages of the bull run. That's my opinion. I could be wrong. But it feels as if that's where we're at. And it's hard to pinpoint those times particularly well. But given what we know about October with crypto, given what we know about the Bitcoin spot ETF potentially around the corner, given what we know about the Bitcoin halving, given what we know about the crypto cycles, I think we're closer than people think. And XRP, I think, will be the one crypto that probably grows the most out of the top 10 cryptos. And I'm here for it. Let me know what you guys think down below. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Peace out.